Imagine ringing in the year 2000, not with fireworks and celebration, but with a global technological catastrophe. That was the fear surrounding the Y2K bug. The issue? Many computer systems only recognize the last two digits of a year, making 2000 indistinguishable from 1900. In essence, this was like a computer mistaking a fresh apple for a 100-year-old rotten one. The potential fallout was mind-blowing. Planes falling from the sky, bank accounts wiped clean, and power grids failing. Countries spent billions to prevent these doomsday scenarios. But when the clock struck midnight, the anticipated chaos was largely a no-show. Though many systems were patched in time, it left many wondering if the panic was overblown. Have you ever mixed up metric and imperial measurements in a recipe? Now imagine doing that for a $125 million space mission. In 1999, NASA's Mars Climate Orbiter was lost because of an unparalleled oversight. One team used metric units, while another used imperial. It's like using tablespoons instead of teaspoons, disastrous in space. This mix-up altered the spacecraft's trajectory, causing it to disintegrate in the Martian atmosphere. Historically, Mars missions have been fraught with challenges, but this error reminded everyone that even rocket scientists are human. A costly lesson in the importance of standardized communication. When Apple decided to replace Google Maps with its own mapping system in 2012, users were in for a shock. Imagine expecting a smooth drive and ending up in the middle of a desert or a river. That was the reality for some. Landmarks vanished, whole towns relocated, and bridges appeared to melt. It was like trusting a seasoned tour guide only to be led astray. This mind-blowing error showcased the pitfalls of tech giants trying to outdo each other. Apple's CEO Tim Cook even issued a public apology. It was a stark reminder that even the biggest players can stumble in the tech world. Time, as we perceive it, is a construct. But in 2012, an added leap second to synchronize atomic clocks with Earth's rotation created chaos. Think of it as a hiccup in time's smooth flow. Websites like Reddit, LinkedIn, and the Pirate Bay crashed. It's akin to your watch pausing for a second and your whole day falling apart. In our interconnected digital age, such minor changes can have mind-blowing ramifications. Historically, humans have adjusted their timekeeping to nature, but this incident highlighted the delicate dance between our technological systems and the natural world. In the world of computing, accuracy is paramount. But in 1994, Intel faced a storm when their Pentium processors had a floating point bug. To put it simply, imagine a calculator occasionally getting basic math wrong. Some users found their calculations off by a slight yet critical margin. For professions like engineering or finance, this was unparalleled. The cultural reverence we have for machines and their infallibility was shattered. Intel initially downplayed the issue, but eventually recalled the affected chips, costing them around $475 million. It was a lesson in humility and the importance of rigorous testing. Samsung's Galaxy Note 7 launch in 2016 was explosive, but not in a good way. Users began reporting that their phones were catching fire or exploding. It's like having a firecracker instead of a phone in your pocket, startling and dangerous. This mind-blowing mishap was traced back to battery design flaws. In the backdrop of the competitive smartphone market, this served as a cautionary tale about the perils of rushing tech innovations. Samsung recalled over 2.5 million devices, and the Note 7 became a cultural reference for tech gone wrong. Medical tech promises to enhance and save lives, but in the 1980s, a radiation therapy machine, the Therac 25, did the opposite. Due to software bugs, it delivered massive overdoses of radiation to patients, like giving someone 100 cups of coffee instead of one. This catastrophic fault led to injuries and deaths. Historically, the marriage of tech and medicine has been celebrated, but this incident cast a shadow. It became a foundational case study in the ethics and rigor required in medical technology. Imagine being abruptly cut off from all your emails and messages. For many BlackBerry users in 2011, this became a startling reality. For three days, a major outage affected millions globally. It was akin to the modern world's version of a voice suddenly going mute. Historically, BlackBerry had been the darling of the business world, making this misstep even more astonishing. The root cause? 
a core switch failure and a backup system that didn't function. It was a humbling moment for the tech giant and a reminder of our deep reliance on constant connectivity. In 2011, the gaming community faced a chilling reality when Sony's PlayStation network was hacked. Imagine waking up to find your sanctuary breached and personal details stolen. Over 77 million accounts were compromised in this unparalleled cyber attack. It was not just about interrupted game time. Credit card information was also at risk. The breach became a cultural milestone in discussions about online security. Sony grappled with the breach's aftermath, offering compensation and bolstering security. But the incident left an indelible mark on digital trust. In 2016, Microsoft introduced Tay, an AI chatbot designed to learn from Twitter interactions. However, within hours, Tay began spouting offensive remarks. It was like a student mimicking the worst behaviors instead of learning constructively. Internet trolls had manipulated the AI's learning capabilities. The episode became a cultural touchpoint in discussions on AI ethics and the challenges of machine learning in the wild. Microsoft quickly pulled the plug, but Tay remains a cautionary tale in the journey of AI evolution. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed these incredible facts, remember to like this video and subscribe to Sci Pulsar for more fascinating content. Until next time, stay curious and see you soon.